find is first of all to thank uh, the party uh, led by the acting uh, uh, president of the given Lurinda, uh, the leader of opposition, members of central committee, you know, senior members of the party, Honorable Professor Kanduruo, Honorable Jean Kapata, who have uh, provided support to our members, our colleagues, uh, at all levels within the party that have come to stand with me in solidarity. Um, this is the culture that we must continue to build as patriotic front because basically it's very clear Misaka Inde Ichilema who will not let go, you will continue to harass members of patriotic front from the grassroots to the highest level. The issue here, Honorable Vice President, is basically Kabwatu. Kabalelala yoba haka inde. Icha ashiala kwambo nukufoyo kupikula mma ediomzi nentambi o mina ndile tulanda mchibemba. My advice to my brother, Ms. Haka Inde Ichilema, we know that you came on the political scene through tribal you know, proposals. But you are now Republican president, and you are supposed to advance one Zambia, one nation. There are sayings in Bemba, and that's how come I'm donating a book to you called Iso Selo Namapinda, so that you can learn how the Bemba language is spoken. We're just saying, think before you act. Otherwise, you are going to crash. Muchibemba barando kutila, munshewa, aire nama fikubuko. If you don't listen to the advice that you are getting from opposition, like the vice president has continued to have press briefings to raise issues that are affecting the Zaman people. Chika chitika kumuse vanya. So we'll continue in Kabwata. We know they are targeting our candidate, Clement Tembo. I'm the campaign manager. They have attempted to intimidate me. It's amazing that one of the conditions they gave me for bond is to lift my fingerprints, which is illegal. They detained me illegally yesterday. Today they have picked my fingerprints. I don't know where Ms. Akainde is taking those fingerprints. Or maybe he wants to incriminate me. That I don't know. Honorable Vice President, my job you gave me is to speak on behalf of the party. And that's my job. I will speak here, I will speak tomorrow, I will speak in Kabwata. That is my responsibility. So let him just bless himself. Manawasa said, I have a thick skin. thick skin. Paranoia in the morning, paranoia at lunch, paranoia in the evening. Number Vice President, I call upon you. This book on internet, I will work in them. Why I'll deliver it on either tomorrow or Monday. I'm quite to go state house to have a pair of sort of evening. I wish you were going to be a professor. I'd like to address myself to members of the party and I'd like to reiterate what I said at the press briefing that I last addressed. And that is to say, brace yourselves for the hard times in which we find ourselves. It's not going to be a smooth road ahead of us. It's going to be extremely hard. And all of us have to be steadfast. What is important is for us to know that we are stronger together and weak alone. The show of solidarity that has been made today for Honorable Rafael Nakachin is what must continue. We must continue on this trajectory. We must not allow anyone to intimidate us. We must make sure that we stand together because this is our country together. And there is no democracy without opposition. This party is here to stay and it's going to oppose and we shall oppose objectives. So I want to thank you, all members of the party, for showing this solidarity. When Rafa Chinda continue to be resolved, we are all resolved. We are all ready to arrest. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wow! Wow!
judgment and experimented with leadership. Look at what we're going through. I think we'll be able to address other issues later. Thank you. All the best. In the yes, good evening. Good evening. sure that fertilizer scandals are investigated and those who are responsible are brought to book. Free education needs to be fulfilled. In Kabwata, they want to win. Even if they change that candidate from Zimbabwe and they bring from Tanzania, we will still beat them. That is a must because the people of Kabwata are speaking on behalf of the Zambian people in protest against increased fuel, increased uh, bus fares, increased <laughs> minimum, and many other atrocities that they have committed in five years. I mean, five months. So basically, that is the message we are taking in Kabwata. So this business of saying, Bana to Kaka, 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 